Hey, hey, hey! I thought it was about time the real reviewer came back and we reviewed some stuff. So we're gonna start with a new thing that I've asked you guys to get involved with. Let me know your crazy food combos that shouldn't be nice, but are. So things that sound like they'd be gross, but they're actually really nice. This can involve cravings that you've had, that you've tried, drunken combinations that you've come up with and thought, actually, that's really not that bad anything and if you leave them or send me them or tag me in them i will um do you a little video of trying your combination so let's get started we're going to do three combos from my post that i did yesterday and i'm excited reading through these comments i'm not actually sure how many people are actually taking the piss and these aren't nice at all and they've just come up with the worst things that they can muster or they are genuinely good we're gonna do three today and we're gonna do peanut butter um, ones because I love peanut butter and I've never tried any of these things with peanut butter before. So we're gonna do three different sandwiches. Um, the first one is from my lovely friend, Becky. <laughs> Becky Coxon, you would have put a peanut butter one, wouldn't you? Peanut butter and cheese and onion crisp sandwich. Now, I fucking love a cheese and onion crisp sandwich. It's got to be on Warburton Blue Bread, it's got to be Lur Pack, and it's got to be Walker's Cheese and Onion Crisps. That makes the best Chris sandwich in the world, in my opinion. And I'm the real reviewer, so I know. Um, everybody, if you've not had a Walker's Cheese and Onion Chris sandwich, you, you, don't talk to me ever again. I'm going to need a slice of Warburton's bread. No one's mentioned, well, some people have said it's got to it's got to have Lur Pack on it, but whenever I'm having a sandwich, I have to have Lur Pack. I'm terrible, me. Even if like, I'm at a restaurant and they bring me like a bowl of soup. I don't know why every time I say restaurant lately, I feel like I'm going restaurant and I feel right weird. But anyway, even if I'm having like some bread dipped in camembert, I've still got a fecking butter on my bread because that's how I roll. I need low pack on my bread, no matter what the situation. It's got to have low pack on it. I'm terrible for low pack, absolutely love it. So I've buttered my bread. I'm gonna cut that in half because um, we're gonna save the other half of the bread for another sandwich that we're gonna have. And let's get cracking. So I've got, it's. I've never even heard this fucking peanut butter. Times are hard, guys. Skippy peanut butter. <laughs> I am quite a food snob normally, and I do get the branded stuff, but we'll give Skippy a go, eh? Extra smooth, Skippy, creamy peanut butter. So we're going to whack some of that on the bread. Get that on there. Love a bit of peanut butter in my life. And then some Walker's cheese and onion. I don't know if it's just me, but I'm dropping excited. Are you excited, guys? And I'm going to score and rate and review these concoctions. We've got loads to get through. So this is going to keep us busy uh, for quite some time. Right, let's go and shit down. I need to do them quicker though, because I think I want to change these into reels instead of videos. But anyway, let's get crack a lacquer in. Maybe I should just do one at a time. One reel at a time. Fuck this. I think the first one's going to be a video. <laughs> little reels i don't know but i've got it ready guys this is my cheese and onion crisp and peanut butter sarnie <laughs> dun, dun, dun. i feel like i need a fucking drum roll or a special little thing that i do before i try it well it could be this no we're never doing that again actually um It's a lot. No. <laughs> no, Becky. I can't taste the crisps. I much prefer a peanut butter sandwich on its own and a, and a cheese and onion crisp sandwich on its own. Together for me. It's not the one. The flavours don't blend. They don't complement. I can't taste. All I can taste is the peanut butter. Hang on. I mean, it's not bad, but I'm a greedy bitch. I love my food. I love all food. Only food I don't like is blue cheese. And there is one of them on fucking list. It's getting a one from me, Becky. It's not floating my fanny hairs. It's not, it's not tickling my nips. It's not, 
it's not giving me peanut butter and jam, which is mm, chef's kiss. Right, let's move on. Thanks, Becky, though, love. If you've got any more, whack them down in the comments. Let's move on to the next one, which <laughs> this one, my God, I don't know if this one's a joke, but this is from the lovely Laura Boxtel. If I've just remembered your name wrong, I'm so sorry. But yeah, th this is the comment. Um, peanut butter and onion. And I actually asked, it's normal onion in the sandwich together. But I guess it's not far different from Becky's cheese and onion crisps, is it? It's peanut butter and onion again, which I didn't think much at last one. But let's get crack a lacquer in. Peanut butter on the bread. I'm not going to need any fucking tea after this. Uh, I think you've got to obviously chop the onion. <laughs> she didn't say she whacked that in sandwich. What am I on about? I'm going to do it thinly sliced. I've had heartburn today as well, which probably isn't the best solution, but at least I'm over my sickness now. Um, otherwise, this wouldn't be good timing. So, like, I'll just put that on and then a smaller one inside. That's got it. Covered, do you think? It's just, I never pick this. Fucking hell. Bottoms up. Why am I scared of it? Sorry, I'm allowed to eat it. Laurie or Laurie or whatever, sorry. That's a zero from me, lover. It tastes like someone's armpit. I don't like it, sorry. I'll have ever tasted anyone's armpit that tastes like that, but it's just really bad armpit just came to mind. We won't be finishing that. But thank you for the advice. Uh, not advice. I can't think of the words anymore, guys. I'm losing my mind. Thank you for the suggestion. Thank you. That's going to give me indigestion. Last but not least. <sighs> and my taste buds are on fucking fire. That onion was so strong. <sighs> oh my God, my ears ringing. <sighs> Donna and Much, thank you very much for this one. Peanut butter. Oh, I need a fresh knife from my bread. I'll just use that one. Hey, what is life? I've even used a spoon. Has anyone used a spoon? They've come in. They're drunk. Oh, you're not even drunk. You're just fucking lazy as fuck. You come in. There's only spoons in the drawer and you really want a sandwich. And so instead of washing a knife, like a normal fucking person, you use the spoon or the fork. Yeah, I do that. So half my bread is prepared and banana, peanut butter and banana sandwich. I've got loads to get through. There's loads of different combinations. We, we need we need a name for these videos. The real, real, real. I don't know. We'll come up with some. Give me some ideas, and we'll name these videos that. So I'm gonna put some banana on the bread on one side. We're gonna fold it over. Put four bananas in, we need quite a bit of banana, and some peanut butter. Mm, so good, I love peanut butter, so bad as well. You know, calorie wise, it's not really the best idea. But it's lovely, and a, a little bit now and again, <laughs> don't do you any harm. Right, are you ready? Peanut butter and banana. Now I've had a banana sandwich and I've had a peanut butter sandwich, but I've never had a peanut butter and banana. Are you ready? Sorry, I'm the ugliest eater. I look like an animal. I don't like it neither. I don't think I like banana sandwiches. It's the texture. It's like slimy nuts. Slimy nuts. It's not horrendous. I 
It's one of them situations where you don't like it, but you do. Hmm. It's the one again. Oh, don't really enjoy any of them for my tea. But keep them coming, guys, and hopefully we'll find some ones that I do like. But I think, um, yeah, the onion and peanut butter sandwich got nothing, and the peanut butter and the crisp sandwich got one, and the banana and the peanut butter got one. But thanks everybody for taking part. Uh, oh, I fair enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that. I hope you did too. Keep loving, keep liking, keep sharing, keep watching, and um, I'll see you again for the next episode of. It's come up with a name. Oh, I've got a pain in my heart. After that, you know, I'm still thinking of a name. So anyway, um, we'll come up with a name later, but I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.